Thing. So that is a tricky thing that Anfantino is doing, sponsoring this tournament, because for the longest time it was against FIFA values to sponsor um, tournaments for uh, based on ethnicities or th small regions. It was always, you know, continental. It's the African Cup, the Euro, the World Cup, things like that. But uh, now you're opening a certain door, and I think other groups around the world and other regions around the world would like to follow. So what are the criteria on which, you know, you base this to sponsor uh, such tournaments? That's, that's something to watch over the next few months and years. Do you think he realized something that... I think he already knew for a while. He was in no way going to top the performance he had on his first contract in that first amazing run. Two, and, two years and five months, nine titles, including a miraculous, incredible three consecutive Champions League titles. There's no way you can top that performance. Coming back to begin with, I think it was a mistake. He knew he wasn't going to perform better, not with the players he had, not with Eden Hazard, who has become a Ronaldo wannabe, but can never live up to the expectations. Uh, Modric, Tony Cruz, these are has-beens. They're still good quality players, but their best days are behind them. In no way he was, he was going to repeat that spell. Coming back was more of a Hollywood sequel. They simply shouldn't have done it. Playing against Stephen Curry is just unfair this season in the NBA, and the Los Angeles Clippers were the latest to suffer the Steph experience. 45 points, 10 rebounds, and 8 out of 13 shots from the three-point line. It's not like the Clippers were having a bad day, but their very best was simply not enough. It was a close game, all the way till the end for a final score of 115 to 113. The Warriors' record goes up to 2-0 with a promising sign that the guys from the Bay are simply back. One of the things I love most about uh, watching football games is that we really, when we come across a good manager, a good coach, uh, we can actually watch how his brain functions on the, on the pitch. The way the players execute, the way they become instruments uh, in the game, uh, it was just beautiful. Today, in terms of uh, defending, uh, the speed with which they covered the spaces, the, the speed with which they shut down any uh, opportunities uh, against the Swiss side, uh, it was impressive. Just when you think there's a counter-attack, just when you think there is a gap, there is a place that they can go to, they just come back together in such harmony and in a nanosecond, it's gone. 